Hello, my name is Beth and welcome to the 8 o'clock news. Tonight we have Ethan. Hi. Josh. Hello. And Kate. Hi. In the studio. Ethan, what's going on? This evening we're going to tell you about some tragic news that happened off the coast of Hawaii. There has been a horrible tsunami in Hawaii. The tsunami was 82 meters high and the tsunami was very de devastating with nine gigantic waves. The tsunami hit this morning at 8.28 a.m. and ended 24 hours later. It was very devastating. About 76 people got injured and five people were killed. This might be the worst tsunami yet. We are going to tell you all about the tsunami that happened this morning and some facts about it. We are going to tell you the tsunami destroyed everything in its path, 78 houses in the first two hours. It also wiped out a whole building. There was a huge mess in Hawaii because a cruise ship flipped over on shore. There was no one in the, sh in the ship, be but some people got injured when the debris hit them. At the end of the tsunami, there were over 900 people homeless. In Hawaii, there was some awful damage and destruction. So we had some people in Hawaii to tell you about the natural disaster and how it is infecting people. Now to you, Hubert. Live in Hawaii, Professor Yusuf from NOAA, the National Weather Service, is going, to, is going to tell us about tsunamis. Professor Yusuf, what is a tsunami? A tsunami is a series of seven or eight waves that can reach up to 85 meters. What is the necessary environment for it to occur? Coastal areas and islands are the main targets. Why do they occur? Tsunamis occur from undersea earthquakes, landslides, and volcanoes. They typically occur at boundaries between Earth's and tonic plates, causing the, water, causing the water to move up or down. Tsunami waves are formed as they displace water, which acts under the influence of, influ of gravity. I attempt to find a stable position again. Now we have Marie, who lost her house in this tsunami. I forgot the pamphlet telling me how to evacuate. Many people drowned in this tragic tsunami. I've lived in this area for 20 years, and I've never seen anything like this. I don't want to lose my home. Where do tsunamis usually occur? Tsunamis usually occur at the coast of the Pacific Ocean in places such like Port Royal Jamaica, Lisbon, Chile, Africa, East Indies, Yoshihama, Sicily, Messina, Sanko, Hawaii, Taiwan, and Japan. Most of these places are in the Ring of Fire. The Ring of Fire is, lo is located on the sides of America, Japan, and Australia. Also, it also is on the sides of South America. That's why Hawaii is one of the most common states in America that get tsunamis. Speaking of houses, what kinds of houses are built in a place that a tsunami usually occurs? Brick houses are built there. It's my day to be my children and my pet. Okay, back to you, Beth. Wow, I hope everything is okay and that people are there that are there say are safe. That seems awful. I hope everybody is safe. And we are all to, in this together. We will all get through this. that things go back to normal soon and hopefully most of the damage will be cleaned up by the end of the month. Well, I hope that things will turn out better than ever. We'll get more news about the tsunami in Hawaii and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for joining us on the 8 o'clock news. Have a great weekend.